Hi guys and welcome back to another video Today we are continuing our playthrough on Mass Effect Last time we found... Uh, we finally found Liara And now we are on a mission we've sort of been prohibited of cruising on Normandy and go to... I forgot the name of the place but we can't get out of here But we've talked to one of our friends and right now I have to check my map because I don't know where I need to go I don't care about Rita let's go to the journal race against time Severian go to Hylos yeah we can't go to Hy to Hylos because we were prohibited but I think we now we need to get back to the Normandy Let's try and see if we can go there. Actually, don't know. Open. Hope this goes well. I have to reinstall my graphics card last time. I don't know how laggy this is going to be now. Excuse me. You're the Spectre, right? Commander Shepard, it is an honor to speak with you. What's this demonstration about? I'm Charles Saraceno of the Terra Firma Party. With Armistice Day coming soon, we're making our voices heard by the alien appeasers on the Presidium. Can I count on your support in the next election? Sorry, I believe we need to work peacefully with other races. We've heard that before in human history. Well-meaning naivete leads to declarations of peace in our time. We can't allow anything like Shanxi to happen again. I don't suppose I could convince you to issue a public statement of support for my candidacy. The support of the first human specter would be invaluable. We need more politicians with the courage to stand up for human rights. Excellent. I'll have my people contact you. Don't worry. We'll take care of everything. Thank you for your time, Commander. Remember Terra Firma on Election Day, because Terra Firma remembers you. Okay. There's very little serious crime in this arm of the Garrus, please. <laughs> Let me use the elevator. With all this exploration of Prothean culture, this must be like a survey for you, Liara. Our travels now are somewhat different from my normal excavations. I would prefer lengthier studies and fewer explosions. The loss of all this Prothean technology is just one more thing Saren will have to pay for. We have to go to the Terminus system fast. I'm lost in here. Come on, elevator. Thank you. Now, where are we? Everyone here seems so busy. So rushed. This elevator is downwards. You will find Chorus Den, Flux, the markets in medieval. Okay. Oh, hello. Thank you. Part of our secondary mission to scan those guys. Hey, been a long time, huh? Have we met? Oh, I, I guess you don't remember me. Lieutenant Zabaleta, I, I worked with your mother. We served on the carrier Einstein. Well, that was 12, 13 years back, though. You were just a kid then. I didn't see her much that tour. The ship was on patrol most of the time. Hey, call your mom up and ask. She'd remember old Zabaleta. She'd vouch for me. Look, I need a favor. I'm kind of short on money these days. I hate hitting you up for money, but a man's gotta eat, right? So, could you spare something? Maybe 20 credits. Yeah, it's not a problem. You're a good kid, you know that? Thanks. You ever wanna come by and talk, I'll be here. Huh? <laughs> Can't afford a ticket home, right? So how are you liking your 
Now I want to go to the Normandy. This elevator leads to the Presidium. There we'll find the Embassy Citadel Tower. Okay. Let's go. Terra Firma Party candidate Charles Saraceno confirms that the first human specter endorsed his candidacy. Are we there yet? Okay, finally. Leg hate it. Can we go to the Normandy? No. A Vin the Sun. Got to use the Mu relay. To go to wireless and stop Saren, yeah. Know that. Citadel Tower. Embassy and Seasick. I'm lost! Let me check our. Journal, yes. Call home, speak with Rita, get a drug, find insignia. This is all secondary missions. We've done a lot of them. Not trying to do much of them because they take more time than is necessary, but. No! Come on. Let's try and go and talk to Nasana. Where there was only silence. It's for here. This very station is the work of the Enkindlers. Their gift to all their <coughs> Sisek Academy, I don't care about Sisek Academy. I just wanna talk with Nasana. Oh, are you serious? am I going to get to Nesana? Maybe through here, you know? Savina. You're the receptionist. I want Nesana. Commander Shepard, I am Nasana Dantius. I see you got my message. You said you had a job offer. I do. My sister Dahlia is a crewman on a cargo vessel operating out beyond the fringes of the Traverse. Her ship was attacked by privateers. There were no reported survivors. I'm sorry for your loss. This is where it gets complicated. Last week, I received a message with her voice on it. Dahlia is alive. The rest of the crew was killed, but she was taken prisoner. The slavers demanded a huge ransom from me in exchange for returning her unharmed. Do you want me to deliver the ransom? I've already transferred the funds to the account they specified. Only they never released her. They haven't contacted me since. I've made a terrible mistake, Shepard. 
I'm a diplomatic emissary. By law, I'm required to report any attempted extortion to CSEC immediately. But I was afraid for Dahlia, so I just paid the ransom. Now she's still missing. And if anyone finds out what I did, I could end up in jail. You want me to find her and bring her back? You only need to bring her back. I've already found her for you. I tracked the ransom payment through several accounts. Eventually, it led to a small mercenary band operating out of the Artemis Tau Cluster. I need you to go to the Merc base, take them out, and bring my sister back. You shall be well rewarded. Don't worry. I'll bring your sister back. Thank you, Shepard. I knew you were the right woman for the job. Come back and see me when the job is done. I will, but now I need to go to the Normandy. How do I get to there? Oh my god! Welcome to Presidium Tourism Terminal 1. There are many points of interest here, including the Citadel Embassies and CSEC Headquarters. On the far end of this level, you can see the Citadel Tower, where the Council meets regularly to discuss matters of interstellar importance. I want to know more about Citadel Security. Citadel Security serves as law enforcement for all regions of the Citadel, though the majority of officers serve in the wards. Executor Palin, a Turian, is the current head of CSEC, but individuals from virtually every species across Citadel space serve as officers beneath him. If you wish to learn more, Executor Palin's office is located in the CSEC headquarters just across the lobby. Goodbye. Good. My first CSEC posting was here on the Presidium. Don't talk to again. Where's the thing that lets me travel? Is it there? No. I'm lost! Don't do that to me. <laughs> guys, since I don't know where I need to go, I'll catch you guys when I'm at the Normandy or when I have more information on how to complete the mission. So, I see you guys in a few seconds. Well guys, we finally here. I finally found the freaking elevator that would take us to the Normandy, so... Let's go to the Normandy, talk to Joker, and go to the Terminus systems. Enter Normandy. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. Anderson, what are you doing here? I didn't send. Him. Damn. Let's go. Get us out of here, Joker. Now. Message coming in. Patching it through. Commander, Ms. Algelani's story on you just aired. The brass isn't happy with the way you treated her. This comes straight from the Joint Military Command. Sir, she was gonna make me look bad no matter what I said. 
Well, there were better ways to handle it than knocking her on her ass. As satisfying as it was to see. Just wanted to let you know what the response was back home. I won't keep you any longer. Fifth fleet out. Okay, let's go. And Citadel. Okay, I wasn't ex. So we need to go to Ilos. On the terminus system. It's here. Ilos. Yes. Let's finally complete the mission. Finally. Message for you, Commander. Just came in over a secure channel. Shepard, this is Admiral Kahoku. I found out who set that trap for my men. The ones killed by the Thresher Moor. Damn, I hope you get this message. It was a group called Serpers. An Alliance Black Ops organization. Top secret, highest level security clearance. They vanished a few months ago. Dropped right off the grid. Nobody knew where they went or what they were up to. They've gone completely rogue, Shepard. They're conducting illegal genetic experiments trying to create some kind of super soldier. I don't have any proof, but I found the coordinates for one of their research worlds. I'm uploading them with this message. They're completely out of control. Somebody needs to stop them. I've done my part. Now it's up to you. This is... This is probably the last you'll hear from me. Cerberus is after me now. I need to disappear before they find me. Damn. Cerberus. But who's Cerberus? Lane. Left his loading screen. Commander? Don't you think we're a little past titles? We're a little past a lot of things. What happens if this doesn't work out, Shepard? Well, we mutinied, stole a prototype warship. If they wanted to get technical, they could throw in kidnapping. We're a hell of an example of humanity's best and brightest, huh? I don't know about the example part, but as far as saving the galaxy, how good are first-timers supposed to be? <laughs> Fair enough. It'll really hit the fan when we get to Ilos. If things don't go well, I want you to know... Well... I've enjoyed serving under you. Caden, you stopped being a subordinate a long time ago. Don't you think it's time to act like it? Battlefield flirting is one thing, Shepard. There are regs against fraternization. Huh, I suppose breach of protocol will be pretty far down the list of charges at our courts martial. You're right. About everything. I think about losing you, and I can't stand it. And the galaxy will just keep going. Everything, even the Reapers, will come around again. But you and I... We... Are important right now. And this is what will never happen again. Us. Shepard. You make me feel... Human. Bunk here tonight, Caden. With me. Is that an order, Commander? Caden, you make me feel like I could take on the universe. And right now, I kind of have to. This can't change anything, Shepard. This is a good crew, the finest I've served with. I don't want to mess it up. Oh, damn. I was feeling the love. It finally happened. Damn. It's been a long time since I've met a woman who, uh... Bridge to Commander Shepard. We're five minutes out from the Mew Relay. You're a sweetheart, Caden. Joker's waiting for you on the bridge. I swear, though, if anything happens to you, take care, Shepard. Damn. <laughs> this is getting more interesting. Let's go. Look at how many 
many gaff ships are here? You're at Hylos. Uh, Commander? We've got company. Talk Have the sensors picked us up yet? Well, stealth systems are engaged. Unless we get close enough for a visual, they won't have any idea we're here. Picking up some strange readings from the planet's surface. Take us down, Joker. Lock in on the coordinates. Negative on that, Commander. The nearest landing zone's two clicks away. We'll never make it in time on foot. Get us something closer. There is nowhere closer. I've looked. Drop us in the Mako. You need at least 100 meters of open terrain to pull off a drop like that. The most I can find near Saren is 20. 20 meters? We'll never get in close enough for a drop. We have to try. Find another landing zone. There is no other landing zone. The descent angle's too steep. It's our only option. It's not an option. It's a suicide run. We don't... I can do it. Joker? I can do it. Gear up and head down to the Mako. Joker, drop us right on top of that bastard. Let's go. This is going to be interesting and I'm going to take Liar and Garrus. No, Kaden. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. this bunker before Saren finds the conduit. There is no way we're getting past that door with brute force. Saren found some way to open it. There must be some kind of security override somewhere in this complex. We will have to find some way to get it up and running again. Let's go. Take out those hostiles! Where? That shield is going to do anything. Well, if you keep running, yes, it will. The hell? Okay, that guy is dead. That one is dead too.
Hello. Goodbye. We've just done a big, big circle. Don't know why. Area secured. Finally. You see what I mean? I think we've done a really, really big circle. Now I'm thinking, where do we actually need to go? Hello. Oh my god. That guy is dead. Right. Take all. Now we go over here. Up here is nothing, so it's down. Down we go. And up we go again. Oh, a lot of this stuff. Die already. Stop moving. those things. Ooh, where are we going now? Down the elevator we go. This place 
place still has power. It must be running off its own generator. This must be the command center for the entire complex. Saren's troops must have sealed the doors from here after he went inside. We will have to figure out how to disengage the security lockdown if we ever want to get inside that bunker. Probably. Are we good now? Skill too low. Skill too low. Skill too low. So where's the thing that I need to... To open because I don't have skill. Skill too low. Wait, 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 wait. Saren already has a head start. We have to go find him before he reaches the conduit. Unless he's already found it, then we're just walking into a trap. That is a chance we will have to take. Hold on. Something's happening. You're too late. Unable to... Invading fleets. No escape. Sounds like some kind of message, but I don't recognize the language. It is probably in Prothean. This recording must be 50,000 years old. No wonder we cannot understand it. The message is all broken up, but I recognize some of the words. It's a warning against the Reaper invasion. Of course. Between the beacons and the cipher, an understanding of the Prothean language would have been transferred into your mind. Not safe. Seek refuge. Inside the archives. What's it saying? Can you make out anything useful? Fault Reapers. The Citadel. Overwhelmed. Only hope. Act of desperation. The conduit. All is lost. It said something about the conduit, but it's too degraded to help. We should go. Cannot be stopped. Let's go. Be okay, we are. We were going over here. So let's go. Another elevator. So many elevators. been here now I'm more confused than ever so elevator elevator find the conduit the security system is disabled return to your vehicle and follow Saren into underground archives okay and here So I think it's over here now that we need to go for 
what I understand, we need to go to our vehicle again. So, hope it's that. Marco? Oh, my eye is itchy. Sorry for my awful driving and cameras and such, but my eyes, my eyes, so itchy. But I never dreamed I would discover anything like oh. this. This bunker might have been the last refuge of their entire species. Just imagine what mysteries it might hold. Imagine what secrets it might reveal. Hey, try to remember why we're here, Saren. Conduit, the fate of the entire known galaxy. I am sorry. I was swept up in the moment. I just hope we have the opportunity to study this place in detail after this is done. I thought Saren would have said some kind of... What are all those things on the wall? Some kind of... containers? They look like stasis pods. The Protheans probably tried to keep themselves alive through cryogenic freezing. Something must have gone wrong. This bunker became... Oh, oh, oh. He's still shooting me. Sorry guys, you're dead. Whoa! Wasn't expecting that. This is awesome! So cool. What is happening? It's a trap. Saren must have set an ambush. I do not think Saren is behind this. Let's go out and over here. Another elevator. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, this is cool. The elevator slides goes down and up the front. Yeah, we have enough enemies for now. The vigil again. You are not Prothean, but you are not machine either. This eventuality was one of many that was anticipated. This is why we sent our warning through the beacons. Looks like some kind of VI program. Pretty badly damaged. I do not sense the taint of indoctrination upon any of you. Unlike the other that passed recently, perhaps there is still hope. This is incredible. An actual Prothean VI, and I can understand it. I have been monitoring your communications since you arrived at this facility. I have translated my output into a format you will comprehend. My name is Vigil. You are safe here for the moment, but that is likely to change. Soon, nowhere will be safe. Why did you bring me here? You must break a cycle that has continued for millions of years. But to stop it, you must understand, or you will make the same mistakes we did. The Citadel is the heart of your civilization and the seat of government, as it was with us and as it has been with every civilization that came before us. But the Citadel is a trap. The station is actually an enormous mass relay, one that links to dark space, the empty void beyond the galaxy's horizon. When the Citadel relay is activated, the Reapers will pour through and all you know will be destroyed. The Reapers can wipe out the Council and the entire Citadel fleet in a single surprise attack! That was our fate. Our leaders were dead before we even realized we were under attack. The Reapers seized control of the Citadel, and through it, the mass relays. Communication and transportation across our Empire were crippled. Each star system was isolated, cut off from the others. Easy prey for the Reaper fleets. Over the next decades, the Reapers systematically obliterated our people. World by world, 
system by system, they methodically wiped us out. Some of you must have managed to survive. Through the Citadel, the Reapers had access to all our records, maps, census data. Information is power, and they knew everything about us. Their fleets advanced across every settled region of the galaxy. Some worlds were utterly destroyed. Others were conquered, their populations enslaved. These indoctrinated servants became sleeper agents under Reaper control. Taken in as refugees by other Protheans, they betrayed them to the machines. Within a few centuries, the Reapers had killed or enslaved every Prothean in the galaxy. They were relentless, brutal, and absolutely thorough. You said you brought me here for a reason. Tell me what I need to do. The conduit is the key. Before the Reapers attacked, we Protheans were on the cusp of unlocking the mysteries behind mass relay technology. Ilos was a top secret facility. Here, researchers worked to create a small scale version of a mass relay. One that linked directly to the Citadel, the hub of the Relay Network. Yeah, it's cool. The Conduit is not a weapon. It is a backdoor onto the Citadel. What happened next? We severed all communication with the outside, and our facility went dark. The personnel retreated underground into these archives. To conserve resources, everyone was put into cryogenic stasis. I was programmed to monitor the facility and wake the staff when the danger had passed. But the genocide of an entire species is a long, slow process. Years passed, decades, centuries. The Reapers persisted, and my energy reserves were dwindling. How did you survive? I began to disable the life support of non-essential personnel. First support staff, then security. One by one, their pods were shut down to conserve energy. Eventually, only the stasis pods of the top scientists remained active. Even these were in danger of failing when the Reapers finally retreated back through the Citadel relay. There were hundreds of stasis pods out there. You just shut them down? You killed them? He couldn't let everyone die. Better to sacrifice some so others could live. This outcome was not completely unforeseen. My actions were a result of contingency programming entered on my creation. I bet they didn't tell the non-essential staff about this contingency. I saved key personnel. When the Reapers retreated, the top researchers were still alive. My actions are the only reason any hope remains. When the researchers woke, they realized the Prothean species was doomed. There were only a dozen individuals left, far too few to sustain a viable population. Yet they vowed to find some way to stop the Reapers from returning. A way to break the cycle forever. And they knew the Keepers were the key. Aren't they under the influence of the Reapers? The Keepers are controlled by the Citadel. Before each invasion, a signal is sent through the station compelling the Keepers to activate the Citadel Relay. After decades of feverish study, the scientists discovered a way to alter this signal. Using the conduit, they gained access to the Citadel and made the modifications. This time, when Sovereign sent the signal to the Citadel, the Keepers ignored it. The Reapers are trapped in dark space. Saren can use the conduit to bypass all the Citadel's external defenses. Correct. And once inside, he can transfer control of the station to Sovereign. Sovereign will override the Citadel systems and manually open the relay. And the cycle of extinction will begin again. Is there any way we can stop them? There's a data file in my console. Take a copy when you go. When you reach the Citadel's Master Control Unit, upload it to the station. It will corrupt the Citadel's security protocols and give you temporary control of the station. It might give you a chance against Sovereign. Wait, where's the Citadel's Master Control Unit? I've never heard of anything like that. Through the Conduit. Follow Saren. He will lead you to your destination. Saren's got enough of a head start. Grab that data file and let's go. Shepard, are you sure? Who knows how much longer Vigil will be here? Even now, the projection is weak. 
This might be our only chance to speak with it, our only link to the knowledge of the Protheans. It is the opportunity of a lifetime. I'm sorry, Liara. We have to stop Saren. Nothing else matters. You are right. I am sorry. My personal feelings clouded my judgment. We... we should go. The one you call Saren has not reached the conduit. Not yet. There is still hope if you hurry. Okay, now we... Now I think we go to Mako again. Let's go. Didn't want to do that. Sorry. All their advanced technology, and the Protheans were taken in by the Reapers just as we were. They failed. Not a time. They've given us a weapon. They've given us a chance. If we can just get there in time. Let's take Severn down. does not deserve to survive. I think it is. Down we go. Oh, lots of stuff to kill here. Show yourselves. You guys are not going to like this. Not at all. You guys are. Told you. Oops. Go back, Mako. Bye! Wait. We still alive? I thought so. No one survives me. No one. Come on, how long do we get there? How long? This seems endless. Oh my There, the conduit. It's incredible. We don't have time to admire the view. We have to get through that relay. And these geth aren't gonna make it easy on us. We found the conduit. No, 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 no. 
this can't be happening. This can't be happening. going to pay oh we have to get there so bye guys conduit can't close 10 9 8 7 Six, five, we're here. We're here. Oh, this is going to be intense. Critical failure is detected across all monitored systems. Please begin emergency evacuation. <laughs> Okay, you guys are really gonna be dead. Oh, yeah. Well, guys, although this is quite a bad place to end the episode because we are on the action I'll have to do it I can't extend this too much so I think we have almost one and a half hours of episode so this will be the continuing the continuing be the continuing of it will be next week so I hope you guys enjoyed if you did smash that like button uh, make sure to share the video with all of your friends so they can enjoy it too uh, comment down below if you are excited for next episode or not and don't forget to subscribe and activate the notification bell for new chip foods so you don't miss any of the next videos bye guys <laughs>